Now I'm convinced we live in a simulation. Snoop Dogg just joined FaZe. And anyway, what's up guys, it's Silvay Moores. Welcome back to another Black Ops 2 video. Um, today we're just, I don't know, we're just playing. We haven't played BO2 in a minute, so I figured we'd hop on. Thank you for the love on the other videos, by the way. The uh, Advanced Warfare video and the Ghost video. I actually had... God, hold up. But there was actually a comment on the AW video asking to see my NA45 triple. Uh, and I, the re only reason I didn't show it in the video is because I don't actually have it anymore. Somehow I lost all my Advanced Warfare clips. Uh, but it's on my YouTube. I'll actually... Hang on, let me play it right now. Seven years ago. Oh my god. I think this was the first one. I don't know if it really counts as triple. It was one shot, but it was the explosion and stuff. I don't know. Oh. There we go, Dizo, he's the one that asked for it, he found it. But another reason I'm on BO2 is because another one of my friends hit a BO2 6 on before I have. And I'm not happy about it. It's been years, it's been so long, and I still don't have a fucking 6 on on this game. Just splits, I have like 30 split DSR 6 on. So the mission today is to hit a DSR 6 on. Pre-patch, post-patch, I don't care. Yeah, speaking of clips and montages and shit like that, I actually have a montage that's being edited right now to go up on Obey. I don't know when it's gonna come out, but the editor actually linked some songs that he wants to use, so. I'm really excited, I'm really excited. I'm not super picky with music uh, in montages that go up on like other channels and stuff. Uh, I'm only super picky when it goes up on my channel, but I, I wanna give this guy creative freedom to do what he wants, and the songs he picked, uh, one of them, I'm really excited. Oh, it's so good. It's not my normal style, but it's so good. You know how sometimes you'll get on like a weird YouTube binge or go down just weird YouTube rabbit hole? For no reason, it's not even a topic that you thought you'd ever be interested in ever but you see that title you see that thumbnail that just piques your interest just just oh 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 hold up wait 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 but you see that title you see that thumbnail that just piques your interest just a little bit and you're like hmm i'm gonna click on that video and then you just get fed like you get spoon fed one after another after another and now you're an expert on the victorian era yeah, that's me. That, that's been my life the past few days. I, I learned that calf heads were a delicacy back then. I learned more about how Kellogg was a uh, goofy guy. I, I guess he thought that bland food made people not want to get laid more? To me, I feel like really good food would have that effect. Like, if I got some good-ass food in front of me, like, I don't want to think about anything else. I also learned that poor people ate rotten seafood because it's... <laughs> I guess rotten seafood is better than no seafood. I have a different opinion on that. I would rather not get sick and die, but that's just me. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm not the type of guy to see food getting to the expiration date or near the expiration date. I mean, like, yeah, that's nasty and throwing it away. Like, if I see yogurt that's past the expiration date, I just kind of sniff it, and if it's okay, like, I'm like, oh, okay, I'll eat that. But nah, the fact that the entire medieval era and Snoop Dogg joining FaZe exists in the same timeline tells me that we live in a simulation. It's all the evidence we need. Oh my god! Oh, you see that lineup? Nah, some guy in the early 1500s was just sitting there eating moldy oysters, and little did he know some rapper 500 years later would join a gaming organization. I mean... I guess little did he know there would be something called gaming too. Before video games, how many people do you think said, Oh, I died? None of them. No, no one said, Oh, I died because they were dead. I don't know. All I'm saying is the world is a lot more peaceful with video games in it. Angry people got a whole lot less time to do angry shit in the real world. Dude, I, this Chris21 guy can actually go fuck himself. Dude. He doesn't even see anyone, bro. Oh my god, Chris! That is the most dumb shit, dude. The fact that geniuses like Stephen Hawking just lived in the same world as Chris21, who shot at nothing and happened to get kills, and then just didn't see a teammate, like an enemy, in the plane. Van He's just shooting at doorway the entire time. He didn't see my teammate in the plain view to his left. It's uh, it's baffling, dude. My window is open and my neighbors can absolutely hear me. They think I'm insane. Dude, I fucking hate this game. I hate gas is four dollars and twenty cents and I don't have a six on. I'm so depressed. The fact that Snoop Dogg and FaZe even exist in the same universe is also incredibly weird. You know what? Fuck it. I still got, like, a 
at least a couple hundred bucks to put towards a montage challenge, I'm gonna drop the clan tag in tomorrow's video. Uh, and I'm gonna put the info all on Twitter. Yeah, I think that's roughly it. If not, I got a video going up tomorrow. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. Have a fantastic day. I'll see you next time.